Hello YouTube. The puzzle map that's quote the mother of all puzzle maps has been beaten by Tyler1. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Paratroxity, which is made by all six of the Paradox Forgers, has been beaten. Uh, this was not me, just for any of you who do not know, it was not me. But we're going to go ahead and get right into this. Um, I'll try to tell, try to explain what you're supposed to do, but uh, will be kind of hard to do. Uh, first of all, you just wait in this corner for a uh, deployable cover. Once you get it, you throw it and it knocks over this column and then it opens that. And this is a speed run, so if I can't talk fast enough, don't make fun of me. But now you jump in this corner until you get a uh, deployable cover and now throw it at the wall, which makes the grav hammer come out. Now you fall down and blow up the gravity lift and go to this corner and then teabag and you'll die because the box is underneath the level of the sky, up in the sky where you die. So now you jump down here. There's a BR up there. Now you have to shoot the turret tripod until it falls, which takes about two clips because you do like no damage whatsoever. Now once that falls, you move it over and jump off of it up onto that ledge and then backwards apparently onto the ledge he's now standing on and now you wait for the turret to respawn the shooting doesn't do anything he's just kinda waiting now once it respawns you jump up and jump off of it now you're up here jump up again and jump up again now fall down on this side apparently and now you block the teleporters with the radar jammers just kinda throw them semi close to it go through that one get the regenerator and now you get another radar jammer and then you swap them and you need the radar jammer so you put that in there then you go and get another one and you throw it where you saw now uh, you have to get another radar jammer, and now you jump, or you shoot, blow that one up, and then you equipment jump up onto that ledge, and then jump up. Now, down to here, there's your radar jammer. Now, you gotta throw it down that hole, or close to it, and then kill yourself with a trip mine. Now, you're back in here, drop down here, there's your regen, and that is open. Now, you go through the teleporter with the man cannon then through that one now you pick up the BR and you have to crouch and shoot the pallet or well, not a pallet actually it's a fusion coil that brings out the soccer ball now you move it right there there's just a golf tee thingy and it holds it there you go through it you get the grav lift now you have to kill yourself so that you can get the mauler and the gravity lift when you go to that room so now you go down here and then jump on top of those sideways now it's right up there so you get all of those now you throw the gravity lift underneath the column and then you drive your mongoose through it now you have to move this block with the uh, mongoose the easiest way to do it is to uh, hit it and then wait for it to respawn, which could be up to a minute and 80 seconds, but this way is kind of hard. Once it respawns, it'll just disappear, so if you just touch it once and then leave it, it should be okay. But um, he does it a different way. He actually moves it out of the way. And uh, just in case you guys can't see, he does actually have the recon helmet. Don't ask me how he got it probably got it from a contest but he's not a bungee employee I don't know him personally so I wouldn't know but you just keep ramming this uh, block until it moves far enough back go ahead and fast forward through it till it moves there he's gotten it to move now 
uh, pretty soon it's going to respawn if I remember the video correctly. You're unblocking the hole down to the crypt is what you're doing. Fast forward again, see if it... Okay, he got off back there, which made it disappear. Don't ask me if that was just random luck or not. But uh, now, you're down here, you get over shields, and you look up and you have to jump and stop the fusion coil from blowing up. Then push it into the corner, and the over shields will respawn on top of it. And now you shoot it a little bit, and it pushes it out. And then it falls straight down, like all the way to the bottom of the crypt, and it unblocks a teleporter. So now you kill yourself and you go through that teleporter. Now you're down here in the crypt and there is a plasma rifle behind the big block. And now you have to... He shoots two bullets. I don't know if that has any significance or not, but it will roll the uh, fusion coil down, which will drop to a grav lift and a regen, if I remember right. Yep. So now you have to carry them both over to that block where you got the plasma rifle. Now he swaps them up there, but there is actually a step up that people like me and you can do it like that. You can just swap it up that. But now you throw the regen there and you go up the main cannon. Now you have to throw the grav lift into the weapon holder. And now you get up here through the teleporter. You get a... Pla uh, uh, power drain it stays in the wall because it's there's a tin cup on the other side and now you jump up and get a sniper and snipe the fusion coil and now you go through the teleporter and you have to jump and then walk off the up off the pallet which is hard to do now you flip the warthog off that teleporter now you have to I don't know if that was intentional or not. I don't think it was. But, um... Oh, no, yeah, it was intentional. Now now you can jump through the teleporter that's in the roof of that part. You jump over here. There's a bubble shield. Got to throw it up on top of that ledge up there. Get another one. Jump back to there. Jump back up. Throw one right there. <laughs> Sorry to be so generic, but... Now there's a teleporter... Now you gotta drop off here and then jump back up and there's a spike grenade and now you bounce it off of that and it, they'll, it'll bounce down and blow up fusion coils as you can see and then you fall to your death. Now you go through the last teleporter, I think it's the last one, no it wasn't. Now you jump up and touch the pallet, get a power drain and then you throw it up on top of that little ledge up there. And now it'll blow up fusion coils, if I remember. Yep. Now you can go through the teleporter. There's the bomb, and boom. So, there you go. That was the mother of all puzzle maps. Uh, beaten by Tyler1. Uh, was not beaten by me. Again, I can't say that enough. It was not beaten by me. Uh, I'm still doing more of E-Man is Back's puzzles, and I'm going to be putting some of my own up and some of my friends, and uh, I hope you have fun on this map, and hope this video helped you. I will see you in my next video.